Hi, I'm Glenn Whitney, and I'm with the National Museum of Mathematics, and I'm here in the Dallas Arts District because we're partnering with Walk STEM, and I'd love to take you along with me this morning, a little taste of what we do in our math walking tours to show the math that's in the world around us. The key here is that math really imbues everything in the world around us. There's lots of things that I could talk about, but I'd like to start with something that we perhaps walk by every day, don't even give it a second thought, and show you that there's mathematics even inside those things. I'm gonna start right here with this traffic bollard. You'll see that all of the bollards are the same shape. Every single one is a cylinder. Why would that be? Is it because cylinders are just more attractive? Cylinders have no corner that you can bump into? Well, those might be the reasons, but there's actually an underlying mathematical reason why you see that shape over and over again. It's because the mathematics of the structure of the shape tell us that we can get the maximum stiffness with the minimum amount of material if we build a bollard in this shape. These brushed steel bollards that we have here embody another mathematical mystery. If you look at the reflections off of the top of the surface, as we know light travels in straight paths, it's hitting this flat surface, and yet you will see curved reflections of the sunlight in the top of this bollard. Where could that curve possibly come from? What is that curve? How can we understand its shape? Mathematics can illuminate these mysteries. 